When we look at distant objects, we're seeing how they were billions of years ago. Even though we can't really travel in time, we're kind of looking back in time when we study astronomy. It's just this cool science that you're not just looking at things that are really cool and awesome and giant and you know, they're also in the past. So we're getting to see how the universe was billions of years ago just by looking up. Our particular program here is one track is physics and then one track is astronomy. We also have a track for uh, physics education, so that means we train people to go off and be high school teachers of physics. Training people to do basic problem solving. They can go off and do jobs in engineering, they can go do jobs in, in science or education in the military. An astronomy astrophysics degree is basically a physics degree. You take all the same courses plus a few astronomy courses. Physics is a good basic degree that just helps everybody understand the universe. I think our two areas of research in our department encompass some of the hottest areas in physics and astronomy right now. On the micro scale, the professors that make these nanoscale devices that will become next generation processors and storage devices for supercomputers. And in astronomy, our professors are studying some of the most engaging questions that we have about the universe today. The formation of other planets around other stars, and professors who study the very origins of the universe itself back 13 billion years to the Big Bang. The University of Wyoming is a fantastic place to do astronomy because we have not one but three research grade telescopes. In fact, this is a place where freshman undergraduates can get their hands on research grade telescopes and get involved in projects as soon as the first week of their freshman year. And that's a rare thing. We have the 2.3 meter Wyoming Infrared Observatory on Mount Jelm. It's the largest research telescope that is owned by a single institution. This means that our undergraduate students and graduate students and UW collaborators can have all the telescope time they need. And this lets our astronomers do projects that no one else in the world can do. The same kind of science right now is going on at Red Butte's observatories. It's a 24 inch mirror. UW's third telescope is the Apache Point Telescope in New Mexico. It's a 3.5 meter telescope. We're a partner with seven other major institutions and this lets us enjoy collaborations and exchanges of students and telescope time. I really liked UW. I really think the physics and astronomy department here is great. I love all the astronomy professors. I, I think all my classes with them so far have been really fun and I've already got the opportunity to do research with my advisor, so that's been pretty cool. Wyoming was pretty much my top choice because of Lyro and because of all the resources I would get here. There's really more of a collaborative atmosphere here than I think in some other pools where it's a lot more competitive. Laramie is a great college town. There's 13,000 students, so there's always a club or a music activity or a sporting activity. It's a wonderful outdoor kind of town where you can enjoy a quality four or five or six years for a degree here. That kind of collaborative, small class environment, I think, is something special that we have at the University of Wyoming.